What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon X walkthrough. Okay, so, yes, we finally found Wolfric. Now we are unable to go to the gym because, yeah, it's finally time to get our eighth badge right here. That's right. Gym time. That's right. Gonna get buff and everything. Gonna get awesome. Alrighty, so look at this. The Snowbell City Gym, and there's Wolfric with his freaking, I don't know, sweater cape? I don't know. I really don't know. Okay, so as you can see, this is all a puzzle, and you're gonna have to like really, really work for it, guys. As you can see, uh, you cannot go through this until you press the buttons and actually align these things. Eventually, it will align to be, I guess, a big old snowflake and all that stuff. So that's exactly what we're gonna do right here. Ace Trainer Emilda wants to battle, and she is coming out with her sneezel. So let's get this. Alrighty, let's go. Let's go with the fire type Pokemon right here. So, yes, this is an ice type gym, and they will be comp they will be battling with some ice type Pokemon. Make sure to bring yourself some freaking uh, fighting types and uh, yeah, fire types. Alrighty, the two big Fs right here, and uh, well, he's coming out with a cloister, or she's coming out with a cloister. So, let's go with the flood bolt right here, and uh, oh yeah, flood bolt about to destroy, kick some ass, take names, and all that crud. Again, some of these Pokemon too are have water type capa capabilities, so just make sure to just uh, you know have a electric type Pokemon there somewhere. Uh, the last type, the last ice type gym, yeah, we sort of kind of didn't beat him. He beat himself because our Pokemon weren't leveled up enough. You know which one I'm talking about? Freaking Price, Pokemon Heart Gold, yeah, that kind of stuff. So there we go, we defeated him, and well. Let's go ahead and press this button right here. We just have to align the spots in order to get to the next area. As you can see, we're trying to get to the blue right here, so let's go ahead and battle this guy. Freeze right there! Oh, well, okay, so I, I, I like the pun, but yeah, whatever. So here we go, Victor with the K wants the battle, coming out with his Dillbird. Dillybird or whatever. I don't know. Let's do this. Let's go with a flamethrower attack right here. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Flamethrower does its trick. And... Well, look at that. Mamoswine's coming out. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Go with Kakashi Hitaka. Now, Kakashi Hitaka has become a an HM slave right here. Don't worry, guys. I will be reteaching them its good moves. I'm actually going to be teaching all my Pokemon different moves after this whole gym because we have to go ahead and uh, take on the gym or the, the Elite Four. Oh yes, look at that. Mamoswine, defeated! Oh yeah, look at that. And we have defeated Victor with a K. No biggie. It is time for us to move this big old snowflake right here. And, well, let's see. We gotta move it one more time right here because we have to go down the middle. And it still won't help us, so we gotta go one more time right here. And... Crud. This would actually work, but unfortunately for us, we can't get out, so we have to switch it up again right here. So, yeah, we don't need another repel. So, let's go right ahead and move on right here. Okay. So, that does that. Okay, so this will actually help us. Now we have to try this once more. Look at that. Do this again, and one more time, I believe. Um, uh, yes. Okay, so there we go. So that's that, and uh, crap baskets. Hmm. Okay, so we have to keep it at that. All right. Let's see. We got this. We got this. There's always when there's a will, there's a way, right here. Okay. All right, that is not how we do it. Come on. There we go, we found a spot. Okay, so going down the middle right here, and let's see, we got two opponents. Let's go ahead and battle them first, and then make our, our run at the gym leader. Okay, alrighty. 
Here we go, another ace trainer. Her name is Shannon. She's coming out with her Cryogonal, Cryogonal, or whatever you call this Pokemon, Cryogenal, or whatever. I don't know, just comment down below, guys. I really am butchering names. Or maybe when I get to uh, the, the, the extra, or the, uh, the opening on Pokemon Pokedex uh, Pro and stuff. Look at that. That big old snowflake has been defeated. And now, coming out with a pile of swine, let's go back to Kakashi Attack, okay, just for the water effect right here. Yeah, buddy. Kakashi. Good time. Okay. Let's go, Pilot Swine. You got this. I'm not rooting for Pilot Swine, but here we go, Surf Attack. Alright. Here we go. And that's how you do it. Oh, God. The volume is going up. Okay. Okay, alrighty. And Kakashi attack, he grows to level 65, and Goku to level 63 right there. And here she's got, or here she's coming out with a Jinx, so let's go right ahead and go back to Godzilla. Look at that. Okay, alrighty. Alrighty, so we're going to be going for Flamethrower. Let's go, let's go, let's go with a Flamethrower right here. For the win! Yeah, buddy! Godzilla taking out the opponents one by one. Look at that! Godzilla grows to level 68. Again, guys, like by this time, you your Pokemon should be nice and stuff, like, you know, beefed up and everything. You don't necessarily need a lot of, like, what, rare candies or anything like that. All you gotta do is just battle. You really have to battle and just to get these Pokemon leveled up. Once you get to the Pokemon Elite Four, it's easy money. Easy, easy money right there. And look at that. Theo wants the battle. He's coming out with his bear tech. Oh, God. All right, bear tech. We're going to do this. Now, when Pokemon X and Y came out, it, it, I guess that was like the first complaint for everybody right here was that, you know, it's a little too easy just to beat the whole game. And that's the same exact thing that I'm hearing from Pokemon Sword and Shield is that, you know, it's become so easy. It, you know, it's whatever. Which, you know, it's, for me, it's okay. It's, it's fine. I mean, if they would have added the whole aspect of leveling up your Pokemon while capturing another Pokemon, that would have been great. That would have been awesome in the first few generations, but they had, they had to come up right, right here. But, I guess they would have, like, actually put a little more emphasis in trying to capture these Pokemon, but on top of that, it would have actually, like, um... What was it? It would have actually... I don't know what I'm trying to say here. It's just like it would have actually uh, put a little more emphasis in capturing Pokemon in the first few generations. They would have been a little bit somewhat easier, but still challenging in, in the first few generations. Because remember, like, first few generations, you needed to grind, literally grind to win the game. And, well, let's see, right here. Alright, and crud, still nothing. I wonder if I'm doing this correctly, and yes, I did it correctly. Alrighty, look at that. I don't remember how I did that. Okay, so, look at this. Okay, alrighty. It's about damn time, okay. That was easy. Okay, so let's go ahead and heal none of my Pokemon. And, well, let's see. I think that's pretty much how we're going to do it right here. So let's go ahead and battle this guy right here. Look at this guy. Look at his gut. He's got a gut of steel. You know what? Ice is both extremely hard and terribly fragile at the same time. You know what that means. Depending on which Pokemon you choose and what moves they use, I could use uh, I could be your most challenging or I could be your most challenging opponent yet, or I could be a total pushover. But that's all right. That's how it should be. Anyway, enough of my rambling. Let's get the show on the road. He hits that gut. Okay, so here it is, guys. The final gym battle against the tank himself, Wolfric. He's got a pretty awesome beard right there. And he's going to be coming out with a bomb of snow. Okay, so he won't be that hard. Okay, Godzilla. Time to finish these guys off. Snow warning right here. Oh, crud. Yeah, we're going to get hit by a few uh, hailstorm, a hail or whatever. But guess what? We're going to go flamethrower right here. Flamethrower quadruple damage onto this Obama Snow. Because both grass and ice type Pokemon right there. And, well, we're going to be buffed by that, uh, that hail. 
And this guy's coming out with a Cryogonal. 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 I don't even know how to pronounce that. Let's go, Kakashi. Alrighty. We can do this. We have the technology to beat this guy. And uh, look at this guy right here. He's looking all mean and evil and all that stuff. We're going to go with the surf attack right here. Do you not know why I chose Kakashi Kataki? I just... Oh, crap. Yeah. Okay, I, I'll, I'll admit something. I will admit something, something right now. I was going for Goku, but I kind of went for Kakashi. You know, kind of quick to the trigger right there. So here we go. Waterfall. Bam. Nearly. Oh, it takes out Cryogonal. Cryogonal. I don't know how to pronounce the guy's name. Please do not yell at me. And we're getting hit by hail again. All right. A Avaluk. Avaluk. Okay, we're going with the man, the myth, the legend. Yeah, buddy, we're going with Goku. And we're not going to hold anything back. We're going to destroy this guy. Look at this guy. It looks like a tank of a Pokemon right now. Okay, let's do this. Mega Evolution. Kaioken Attack. Oh, uh, yeah, look at this. This Pokemon is all beefed up, ready to kick some ass. Bring it. So here we go. Close combat. For the win! Suck it, Evolute! Yeah, buddy. Alrighty. 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 And uh, look at that. Flub Volt, level 61. And that's how you do it, guys. We defeated the big man himself. Oh, yes. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling great. Oh, yeah. Okay. Impressive! Your Pokemon fought with great courage. I can tell you that you trained your Pokemon well. There it is, guys. The final badge. Oh, yeah. Oh! The Iceberg Badge. What you have there is called the Iceberg Badge. As long as you have that, and and all your Pokemon will surely look up to you in their absolute best in battle. Let me give you this, too. We get ourselves the TM13 Ice Beam. A very, very good move. You know what that is? It's the Ice Beam. This move has an accuracy of 100%. Not only that, but every once in a while it will freeze its target too. I hope you learned a valuable lesson today. Being rigid, it, being rigid can make you tough, but it can also render you fragile. You're better off being flexible. You know what I mean? Some people are fluid like water and can adapt to their environment without changing what's uh, important on the on inside. Not me though. I guess I'm too stubborn. Maybe that's why I love ice types. Huh. Well, look at this. Look at that. Holy crap. Oh my god. Okay. All right, Wolfric. I see you. I see you. You try to impress. This is why you're the last gym leader, because you're awesome. And look at that. I'm sliding down like a pimp. Oh, yeah. What's up? I'm here, baby. Okay, so that is that right there. And, well, once you win the last badge, here you have Wolfric coming out, and the only man that's ever believed in you is like, there's a future champ I know and love. Looks like you trumped our old gym leader. It's never a bad thing to test your limits of your strength, am I right or, or am I right? And since you're such a star, I guess that means that you're off to your Pokemon League. Oh, damn, I am going off to the Pokemon League. You know what? You have all gym badges now, so there is really only one thing left to do. It's time for you to head off to the Pokemon League. Listen up now! Trust in your Pokemon, and there's no limit what you can achieve. That's right. Words of a wise man. Words of a wise man. Alrighty, so... That is pretty much it right there, guys. We won eight badges and all, and now it is finally time for us to go to the Pokemon League. Um, yeah. So, what's left right here now is that we're going to go into a separate route. I believe it's route... Let's see. we got to go to the map right here. I can't... Just assume routes here. So here we go, town map. So the next town, or the next thing that we have to do is we're going to go into Route 21. There's going to be quite a few trainers right here, and the move tutor is right there. On top of that, we're going to be going straight into the entrance area of the Pokemon League, which is Victory Road. And let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. And then after that, we're going to go straight up to the Pokemon League. So it's going to be a few episodes before we get there. And then just finish it all off. So, yeah. 
we're gonna get there pretty soon so again thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys next time Thank <laughs> you.